Marjorie McIntosh. I'm a retired professor of history at the University of Colorado at Boulder. The Boulder County Latino History Project matters to me for three main reasons. First, as a historian, I believe that what we know about the past should include everybody. Until this project started, Latinos were virtually invisible in the standard history books of our area. Now we are able to show that Latinos have been essential members of our community throughout the past century. The development of Boulder County as a diverse and vibrant community has rested upon Latino contributions in economic, social, and cultural terms. The Latino History Project also matters because of our work with teachers in the public schools. Right now, most children go through the local schools without hearing much at all about Latinos. Through our summer workshops, we are helping K through 12 teachers write classroom lessons that draw upon the material we have assembled. We want students to learn about Latino history and culture all through school because it is an important part of our history. When Latino topics are embedded in the curriculum, we believe that Latino students will gain a sense of pride in their own heritage and a more positive identity. For non-Latino students too, it is important to realize that Boulder County has profited from its diversity for more than 100 years. We believe that our sources and lesson plans available on our website will be useful to teachers and students in other communities as well. They provide engaging human examples to supplement units that are currently taught only at the state or national level. Lastly, this project is valuable because it is community-based. It shows that local people can tell their own stories and play key roles in documenting their own history. Our 100 volunteers have made this work possible, including doing dozens of oral history interviews and finding or creating 1,500 primary sources that are now available on our website. The project's financial support has also been local. We've had generous help from foundations, businesses, private individuals, the University of Colorado at Boulder, and our two school districts, St. Brain, St. Brain Valley and Boulder Valley Schools. Perhaps our project can serve as a model for other community-based projects too. <laughs>